Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing my dorm room tour. So I'm just gonna do this more vlog style and just walk you through it. So yeah. So here is my mirror. Put a bunch of stickers down on it. So I got this one when I worked at Tilly's. That is a swim company I rep for. A lot of these are Brandy Melville. Yeah, all of these are Brandy Melville. This one's my favorite, the Hawaii one. And this mirror used to be black. I painted it white before I got here. I bought these for my roommate and I. It's C&M for us. It was on, how do I explain this? Okay, so the C and the M were on the front of the door, but we took everything off the front of the door because long story short, like, We've had some problems with people on this floor, so yeah, I'm just going to leave it at that. And then I'm not going to show you her side, obviously, because she's not here and that's not fair. Okay, now I'm going to show you everything that's like on my desk. Here I have my towels, and my boyfriend's mom embroidered them with my initials in a monogram, and I'm obsessed with them. Um, my sister bought me this Keurig for my birthday. It is so useful, guys. Like, I think I have the Keurig 2, yeah, the Keurig 2.0. Um, it holds a lot of water, but I usually use it just to get hot water for, like, tea. Um, but I guess I figured out how to brew Keurig coffee really well because everyone loves how I brew. I have these lights, and they're from Amazon. I can link them down below if they're still available. Oh. So moving on, I have this um, wallflower, but I don't have any things for it because next week is Thanksgiving break. So during Black Friday, I'm going to go shopping for some new smells. That's my camera charger right over here. And obviously my charger and the lights are plugged in. Okay, so you guys are going to laugh at me when you see that I have a Brita filter, but I only paid $9. I went coupon crazy, so it was marked down to $15 instead of $20 in the store. And then I found a coupon on a different Brita filter. And the girl, like, didn't realize that it wasn't meant for this one. So I got this for $9. I don't know if it's, like, a small one or anything. But, I mean, it works. It's a filter in it. Per fil it came with a filter in it, too. Um, but per thing, you can get 32 gallons of it. This is only the third time I filled it up. And I usually just use that to fill my Keurig. So here's my laptop. It's, like, upside down. I can show you all the stickers if you want. So my mom bought me a bunch in Hawaii. Aloha always. Hawaii is my favorite place, guys. Seriously, if I could live there, I would. Um, this is a tattoo shop, I think. Yeah, Spikes in Lanai. And my mom was going to get a tattoo, and then the guy was just out. Like, there were family issues, so she didn't get to. Pub Night is a Colorado Mesa thing. Gamma Phi Beta. I actually haven't even been to Pub Night. That's funny. Um, Gamma Phi Beta. We got stickers when we first um, were accepted into the sorority on bid day. Hawaii, again, of course, another Gamma Phi Beta. So, under my desk, don't even look for very long, but those two buckets were meant for, like, that has, like, cleaning supplies and paper towels and stuff, and that one is supposed to have all my school stuff, and as you can see, it's just a mess, and my little trash can. My chair, that is a gray blanket that I got from TJ Maxx Home Goods. The turquoise one is one my boyfriend's mom got me again. She literally spoils the crap out of me. I don't deserve her. Um, and she embroidered my name on that, just M-E-J-N, and then obviously, as you can see, again, the monogram is on this pillow, which she surprised me with, too. Like, guys, I'm so spoiled. Okay, so my mom didn't let me get new bedding for college, so I finally just got a cheap duvet cover, and I don't really like a cheap one. I have my, um, one that has that paisley pattern. The one with the paisley pattern is bagged up, and I'm taking it home because I only have, like, three weeks or something left after thanksgiving break and then i'm done so the gray sheet set it's like the t-shirt kind i can kind of look over there gray like it's the t-shirt kind i don't know how to explain it they sell them at bed bath and beyond i totally think it's worth the, worth the price they're so two gray pillows two of those pillows also the story on this little guy on the end of my bed i literally have no clue where to put him Okay, so for the gray little stuffed animal that I have, not little, he's huge. 
I was sick at, earlier this week and I was literally being such a baby and I took my boyfriend to the store and he said oh yeah like we we're gonna go check out like get a red box movie and he said yeah um I just need to go in and get some cash and then I'm like sitting out front and he comes up and I see him in my like so, like my side mirror and I'm like what in the hell he bought me it and it's literally so expensive guys like I do not deserve it but he's super soft oh my god and I used to have another dog that my boyfriend's sister gave me that my cat lays on so I have a feeling if I take him home like my cat is gonna steal him like for under bed storage oh my twin gift is over there for my twin she hasn't gotten her gift yet from me she'll get that in like two days and then I have buckets so that's just an overview first one is meant for pants I have one pair of shorts just sitting in there because I started to get messy again second bucket these are all my jackets it's just easier to throw them in a bucket guys like I know they get wrinkly I have a steamer if I need it and it's just easier access this next bucket is just bags so I have a couple backpacks obviously so and purses and little like wallets I throw in here and in this one this is my t-shirt box I think I have too many t-shirts so if I show you these are stacked the same way too because I have too many but I found the turquoise buckets are from Walmart these turquoise buckets that are darker teal wait why is this one sideways that really irritates me um these ones are from Home Goods, and I forgot to tell you, those two are from Walmart again. And then I have my Gamify bag and a crossbody bag that is from um, Nordstrom Rack. Hopefully this will focus in, but this is the, like, corner of my room. I so that's, like, an overview of here. This stuffed animal gets in the way of everything. Okay, so we're going to start on this side of the room. Out of the way. This corner is really small, guys. Okay, so starting with my cork board. Sorry, the light is coming in. If you want to see my view, it's literally, I hate it. I'm right next to the front door. I thought it was beautiful the first, like, week or two. And then I realized this pathway right here, like, people sit on this ledge outside my window, and it's just really creepy, and I don't like it. So, okay. So I have pictures of my family because my parents split up, and obviously I'm the only one who's going to keep, like, family pictures <laughs> Because it's just me from my mom and my dad. Um, these are just other photos. They're not really organized anyway, guys. Like, some of them are covering other ones. Like, I'm going to fix it when I move. But until then, I'm not going to really mess with it. And it's just, I thought that was a really cute idea. It's just like a corkboard wall, basically. So if you can do that, guys, it's super cheap. I think it was like $8 for the four of those. That's a picture from senior night um, playing soccer. And it's me and my mom. And for our senior banquet, everyone kind of signed it, as you can see. So, yeah. Here's a top-down view of my closet. But this bucket is like a chair, but it holds all of my bathroom stuff because I have a lot because I'm a girl. The curtains are white, like sheer, and I like that you can still see, and it makes me clean my closet more. But at the same time, people can't like just look into my closet because I bought them, and I put it really high. But they're from Target, and they're like extra long, and I suggest you get those so that you can put it up high so it actually covers everything. These three like twine bins I don't know where my mom got them. We've had it as a storage organizer since I was like a little kid. And they go inside a drawer set. But because I'm moving soon, I'm taking the like actual structure home and leaving the box. This purple M, I don't... Oh, sorry, guys. It's white. I spray painted it white, but it was purple as you can see. Um, But I forget where I got it. I think it was like Hobby Lobby or something silly. But you can have my recycle bags for when I go grocery shopping up there. My shoes so i've tried to consolidate that bucket pulls out and it's got electronic stuff in it oh and these buckets are also from walmart guys walmart has amazing stuff this is like my sandal bucket moving down booties and heels boots oh my shower shoes are right there too and just another pair of boots and then obviously my slippers are right there and i have my tote that my mom gave me from vera bradley I think that's a discontinued pattern. Sorry about that, guys. So this is my laundry basket. I started with like a white one that was cheap. And I gave that to my boyfriend. And I went ahead and bought this one. I decided to not hang all of my clothes, guys. So I only hang stuff if I think it's necessary. Or if like I reach for it a lot. But that's why my closet is so empty. 
this is the welcome home like to gamify beta like with my name on it and i just have it back there because i don't really know where to put it um and then i can kind of show you these drawers if you want but they're really messy guys so oh, i tuck this usually back here the top drawer is what every girl does it's bras and underwear oh i have a pair of tights and socks and i have too many i know i know second drawer i just have like a bundle of clothes honestly i've gotten so bad with folding and it's not worth it if it's stuff you reach for all the time the bottom drawer is food stuff and it's just a mess okay. so if we move back across this is my window so i want to go in order so my aloe plant is the last like the most recent one i got um this is aloe plant i was with my niece and i bought it at safeway and it has literally sprouted like crazy and i don't even water these guys like i don't know how i haven't killed them yet um i know you're not supposed to water them guys but still like it's insane so this literally started as one little leaflet like this but like big and it has sprouted into like millions of them I don't know why my autofocus is freaking out. I had in one of my like big planters that I had posted about a long time ago. I don't know if any of you guys saw that, but I took him out. I had huge planters when I first got here and the flies coming off my plants even now is so bad. But when I had the two huge ones, like it was ridiculous. Then the last thing is this salt rock and I got it at Bed Bath & Beyond again and it's a light up one. Honestly guys, I would just opt for a normal one like I don't like the colors it lights up with, so. Back this way, obviously you saw my desk already. I keep moving the stuffed animal. He's just like in the way in this video. But this is my nightstand. I pulled my bed off the wall so it looks more homey. So it's not like a dorm room where all your stuff is shoved up against the wall. The whole situation with the window makes it really hard to move my stuff around. Though. This is my cork board. And all the photos are even like covered right now. I really, I had it hanging but it fell off the wall. So I'm waiting to get more hanging hooks in case I am moving. I made this as a DIY. There's a YouTuber who has it out. It's so easy. All the stuff is from Walmart. And like you just make, you can make your own stuff pencils and like exacto knife them out and stuff um here is my gamma phi beta notebook so it just is a way because when you're like new into a sorority they teach you all about it like the history of it in a fun way it's not like extra class or anything from pier one imports i believe and there it came with two of them i don't know where the other guy went i think i took him home but i don't really remember it all I have two catch-all trays. This one is more for like my retainer and like little jewelry like rings and I have a pin in it. I know it's gross guys I'm sorry but no one else chills in here. Home deodorant like hand sanitizer and I think I have like a little lens on my f for my phone inside the shot glass. I showed this in the video that I went to Arizona in but it's literally still my favorite thing ever guys like the rest of my shot glasses were put away. Um, I obviously have my little mirror. I have no clue. I think my mom bought me that. I moved down in the drawers so top drawer is like junk there's makeup stuff it's like medicine it's just a lot of stuff that i have in there the second drawer is food and shiz and you i don't know why i said that word and the last one is like cooking okay so this tray i've had forever i don't even know where it's from it's really nice though to have for dishes because it's like there's holes in it so the water after you rinse dishes like can go right through it and drip right out or you can put a towel in there or whatever this is the stuff for when i go to the bathroom guys i'm getting so hungry so that's my little bag with like my toothbrush and face wash and everything and i usually just stack it on top if i'm going to the shower look how cute my toe is it's from pb teen pottery barn teen and it's like in the dorm section and it was on sale but if you can see this my boyfriend's mom again embroidered it with my name I really have no home for this little bucket it's all of my makeup guys and i need to downsize even more which if you've seen me ever like i did a makeup collection and deleted it because i just thought it was silly but i've downsized tremendously like it's insane and then i just have my buckets and there's like um space bags in here for when i move out and I have a bunch of extra recycle bags. So here's just another overview of my room. I like how it doesn't feel like a dorm with the stuff that I've done. Oh, and I forgot to show you. This is the last thing, guys. I just want to show you everything in my room. So on my window, I have a dream catcher and I've 
totally don't remember where I got this. I want to say thank you so much for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe down below. And go ahead and check out some of my last videos. I'll leave them hyperlinked. This is like a new feature YouTube has. And I think it's super helpful. I don't know if you guys want to watch them, but I'll leave some linked up here. And go ahead and check out my last video as well. Okay. And hmm, what else? If you have any other questions, let me know. But um, yeah, other than that, I'm going to go now, guys. So thanks for watching. I'll see you later.